this is Sandy from Scrapbook Blessings Club and today I have our April 2015 card kit. I know it's a little late but because of shipping and manufacturer and all that behind the stuff things that stuff that goes on um, we just got it but we're gonna go ahead and continue and do the blog hop and we're gonna give one of these kits away so Better late than never, I guess, especially with all the goodies that's in this kit. So let's go ahead and get started. I did a little different. I just kind of laid out the whole kit to begin with. Um, we're going to start with our six pieces of American Craft Pastel 6x6 six six, um, cardstock. Nice and heavy. Love this cardstock. The paper pack that we're doing, um, the page feature is Fancy Pants Office Suite. So you're going to get six of those. They are one-sided. So you get six by six, six of those. So 12 pieces of paper. Um, we have die cuts that are from Fancy Pants also. And we're going to do some gems. So these are part of the embellishment. The gems are um, Queen and Company Sunflower Gems. They're really cute. Let me pull them up and show you. Look how pretty those are. Of course, we have some metallic gold thread that we're going to use on a card to help threading. Um, let's see, the ink is Color Box Pistachio. So we have our little ink pad. We have one of these um, almost every time in every kit. We have Glossy Accents, which I love. If you haven't used Glossy Accents, you're going to love this. You can use it as an adhesive, and you can also use it to, um, oh, pop up, put a little glossy glossiness on top of your, you know, embellishments, your hearts and stuff. I'm going to show you how to use that one in our, our video. And let's see what else. Oh, I have from Kaiser Craft, these cute little wooden hearts. Very cute. And last but not least, our stamp. Our stamp this time is, um, from hot off the press. It's a small stamp. So it's a, um, little one let me see here it's gonna measure two and a half by one and a half and it says you you're terrific and it's this cute teacup love it so that's our feature stamp so like I said this is our April kit and um, if you want to get it you can go ahead and look on our blog www.scrapbooksblessingsclub.com for the details you can win this kit if you um, hop along on our blog hop um, we're going to go ahead and do that May 1st and also let's go ahead and get started I like to make a card using um, the elements of the kit so let's get let's get going with that okay so here I have my everything I'm going to need to make my card and let's go ahead and get started And there we have our easy card, card kit card. Um, literally, this card took me, um, without it being fast forwarded, it, it took me six minutes to do. So let me show you what I did. <laughs> I went ahead and I did my easy matting. So if you want to see um, a little pin test, a little tutorial on how to do that, you can go ahead and look below in the playlist. Um, so I did my matting using the solid cardstock and the paper 
I used one of the die cuts that came in the kit and then here is the wooden heart. I went ahead and used my finger and I inked up the wooden heart with the pistachio color box pistachio. Then what I did and I glued the wooden heart using the glossy accents. So that's why I said the glossy accents is great. I have um, I have stock in this so <laughs> I was excited to see that in the kit because I can never get enough of glossy accents and then to finish off the card what I did is I took an eraser now this eraser is one that I've used so it I knew it would give me these cute little polka dots um, I just love this is like my new fun technique that I like to do so it gives me the cute little polka dots but it doesn't make them solid because I've actually used the eraser so if you want a solid polka dot just get a brand new pencil eraser and it works great and then last thing last but not least is I don't know if it's gonna show up on the video there I can kind of get a little bit you see the flowers on all the flowers here that is all the glossy accents and it kind of gives it a gloss and a little pop on the card and then right here on the heart you can see it too so very cute I could even um, you can even emboss or glitter the heart and then put the glossy glossy accents will go on anything it's great um, and so there is my little you know card demonstration so go ahead check out the rest of the video and you'll see the other cards from the design team what they did with them and um, I hope to see you next month bye bye <music>